You know, it's interesting to imagine what two fictional characters could be like in a fight against each other. You know, wondering, who could win? And that's what I've been wondering with Needle Mouse, or Sarah Henderson, and Rerun, or Lilith Rose. Don't say fuck to me, fuck why? I'll say fuck to whoever I want to say fuck to! Fuck you! Fuck you! So who would be able to win, the Purple Mouse or Spaghetti Sonic? Now I do want to state something. From what I know, Lilith is kind of an overpowered fuck. So I need to have a fair fight here, there's gotta be some reasoning going on. So let's break down the various aspects to their characters. Well, of course they're vengeful spirits and they want to get revenge. And they're also, uh... Well, if they're dead, they can't be killed. So, they're basically immortal. Well, they're both dead, so what would be the point of them fighting? Well, they could still one-up each other some way, somehow. Which, don't worry, I'll get into. Both of them have their own worlds that they reside in. Sarah has a black void, but occasionally there's a hint of non-darkness. And Lilith lives in her cartoon, I guess. Or the cartoon realm. I'm imagining it's something like this. We don't really know what it looks like. And so, they're able to do whatever they want with these worlds. So, let's get into their combat. Starting off with Needle Mouse or Sarah Henderson, she can change her appearance, mess around with her world, and has Sonic's trademark strength. Uh, so I guess speed, maybe punching in there. She also has this ability where she can manifest nightmares. Rerun Lilith has far more abilities than Sarah, I would say. She has limb regeneration, she can run pretty fast. I'm just imagining her running on all fours and it looks pretty damn cool in my mind. She can take whatever cartoon character she wants and use them to their liking, like a puppet. So just like manifestations of them. That is only a half of their abilities and I know there's probably some I'm missing out on. But depending on where they're fighting, if Sarah decided to fight Lilith in her world, I think there's a chance she could probably one-up her. But if Sarah was fighting Rerun in her world, well, she might get screwed over. But this is something that I was thinking about. So it's stated that Sarah doesn't need any sleep, but we don't know that about Rerun. You know, what if Rerun actually takes naps? I know that's not even likely, but... You know, maybe Sarah could use that nightmare ability of hers to just stun the crap out of her. Maybe like a nightmare about her dead family. Well, that would depend if Sarah even fucking knows about her dead family. Probably not, but it'd be interesting. This could probably fuck Lilith up and make her mentally unstable because, well, she is. And that could make her quite dangerous. But, you know, Sarah could use this to her advantage. Now, definitely, Lilith can overwhelm Sarah with different copies of cartoon characters. And her fighting style is pretty similar to Spinel's from what I know. Uh, here's like a gift of what that would probably look like. This uh, footage of Spinel beating up stuff. I just threw this in. But if they were in Sarah's world, I think Lilith would lose access to this stuff. She could still have the Spinel combat style going on, but it might make fighting Sarah harder. Sarah does have, a, like, the sonic speed to her, so she could probably just punch the shit out of Lilith until she gets tired. And Sarah could just make the world a living nightmare as she just beats the shit out of Lilith. I know she can regenerate her limbs, but that could get quite tiring. So going through everything I mentioned, who would win? Of course, Blonde, but no, nah, I'm just kidding. I think depending on where they're fighting, if it's in Sarah or Lilith's world, well, one of them has a chance. I forgot to mention these, but they're not that important, but yeah, they have a chance one of them. Now, she definitely can have more of a fighting chance, but you know what Sarah has? Giving you manifestations of your dead family that died in a car accident. Yeah. Yeah, that's, uh, that's pretty fucking dark. So, who do you think would win? Let me know in a very long-form comment so I can understand your reasoning of this, and I'll see you guys next time, and bye.